Hey guys, we're back. This is Friday Night Magic, and we are gonna continue on this campaign. Uh, we're gonna fix, fi fix. I mean, face this cursed existence. Uh, last time we didn't win against the Living Death, but I was almost there. But it's okay. So we're just gonna move on. <laughs> you don't need to. You don't need to to see me win that. Uh, as long as it's entertaining for you guys, I'm okay with it. Uh, Within a dank cave, a coven of chanting witches surrounds a skeletal being glowing with arcane power. You take a tentative step forward. All eyes fall on you, a cursed one. The lich murmurs. The killer of your kind hunts you. That's good to know, bro. All right, let's beat this. Let's see, uh, oh yeah, I chose the blue deck this time. It's because the green deck that I have, I don't really have that many green cards. Uh, so, this is my main deck. I don't know why I chose the blue deck. I was just trying to be experimental when I first started this game. Uh, I think uh, we're going to roll with this. Let's keep that hand. Bust out this basic land. what they got I have no idea what those cards are put this plane down first uh, equipped creature has flying that's awesome but I don't have enough for a creature right now. So we're gonna continue. Cool, they got spells. Seems to me that card draws a land. As soon as it's played. Let's find out real quick. Sacrifice the following wins. Search your library for a basic land card and put it onto the battlefield tapped. Then shuffle your library. Cool. Return target non land permanent to its owner's hand. Sweet. Wait. Return target non land permanent to its owner's hand. So, uh, I'm not sure I understand. <laughs> See, I, I was thinking that it would take uh, one of the lands away, but I'm not sure that's the case. Choosing all that? Okay, so I'm taking the spell away. Chant player. At the beginning of Enchanted Player's Hug Peep, that player puts the top two cards of his, his or her library into his or her graveyard. Whatever. Just use it. any monsters going on here uh, crap or we do but we just don't have uh, the right spells I'll just stick that spell on there or enchantment or whatever it is you call it I'm pretty sure I would have got dominated right now if they had played some monsters. Because I got nothing going on here. Oh, top of my deck. Oh, snap. Alright, see. We got a. You may tap or untap target creature. Put 
shoot you down. Creature's abilities. You can't activate a creature's ability unless you've controlled it since... Okay, yes. Gotcha. Hey, and it's flying. I didn't notice that. Uh oh, we got a creature. Death Touch. When Bitterheart Witch dies, you may search your library for a curse card. Put it onto the battlefield attached to target player, then shuffle your library. Okay. Crap, man. He's taking my cards away, so he's pretty much throwing my deck. Throwing my deck away. Everything to the graveyard. Sucks. We're gonna attack. Give me something good. My break bowl, crap. Good thing I have a flying creature. I won't have to deal with that block there. At the beginning of Enchanted Player's Upkeep, Curse of the Peter's Heart deals one damage to that player. Crap. So this guy's got nothing but lands, nothing but spell tricks. Target player draws two cards. Yes, please. I want some cards. Attack. We got this. We got this. Uh. Crap, man. I noticed that it's, uh, taken away even though I haven't done anything yet. My cards are disappearing. Put that land there. Put this in there. I feel like he's rushing me. Phantasm next. Whenever a creature deals combat damage to an enchanted player, put a one counter on that creature. Dang, dude. Look at all those spells. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's ahead of me by one point. What the heck is happening here? Put that land down. Put this. Put you. Time to 
attack again. Wipe out all those spell cards. See, so yeah, I can block these guys. Uh, destroy the one on the right. With one of my guys. I think I'll do that. Let's block with this guy here. Block. <laughs> tap target creature. It doesn't untap during its controller's next untap draw card. What the heck? That is jacked up, bro. target creature with power four or greater. redeem myself. Look at that graveyard. Declaring attackers and blockers. You can't play cards or activate abilities while choosing which creatures to attack. Or... What? Give me something good. That was probably something good. And I wanted that.
champ player. Man, what's up with you? Finally, I got something right. Deal two damage. I couldn't do much. I'm dead. What the heck? I don't know about you guys, but I feel like I need to redeem myself right now. Yeah, yeah, load. Come on, bro. All right, we're keeping these. Yeah, let's go. I got this. Must work quickly. The opponent has spells. What, you already put two spells down? What the heck is going on here? No power here. Maybe I should have put the land, I mean, the plane. Crap, man. There it is. There's the graveyard crap. Nobody got time for this. Suraku, Surkar, Banisher, enters the battlefield. You may return target tapped creature to its owner's hand. You got that. Exactly what I'm gonna do. But I can't use it yet. Target an online permanent to its own. He's got two of these. Does that mean that they stack? I haven't been paying attention. Does four cards go into the freaking graveyard? I have no idea. But well, we're putting you back in his hand. Attack.
does your opponent's control get? Negative four, negative zero. Um, maybe what I need right now. All right, brother. I attack you with three, two. Dang, that's not gonna be enough. I won't be able to kill that guy. He's got six life, so I'll just bring his life to one. Won't do damage to me though. At the end of that turn, stuff goes back. Bummer, wrong time to use that. Wait a minute. Oh man, I could have used the righteous blow. Come on, just 13 life he's got. Take him out. Of course, that's the card that comes into my hand. Just go for it. I'm gonna lose that creature. All right, I'll deal two damage. To you. So both of those guys. Cards are disappearing. Sometimes I'm wondering, you know, I'm wondering, how did I even beat these guys in the first play? On the first place. I've got two of those. What do we have here? Exile target creature or enchantment. By attack. They'll block. Take me down to one. Still be alive. For the turn. Adventure Priest enters the battlefield, exile target creature, and opponent controls until leaves the battlefield. Okay, good to know.
Well, sure, let's take one of those out. That's not what I want. Sweet, we got something. Flying creature, baby. All right. Can't speak. I think we got this, guys. I think we got this. Chant player creature enchanted player controls get negative one, negative one. All of them? What? You can do that? Holy crap. Equip the creature has flying. Yeah, let's put that sucker up there. Put that thing in. Activate. Make you fly. Oh. What the heck am I doing here? Activate. Make you fly. That's nice. Every point counts. of my cooters get entirely wiped out, I win. Boom shaka. Boom shaka lock. Man, if I only had one for this guy. Awesome as that. Continue. Attack for the moment of truth. You will attack 
and you will attack. That's what I'm talking about, guys. Woo! You guys are my witnesses. Tell me what you think. Uh, yeah. <laughs> this has been Friday Night Magic. I hope you liked it. Uh, leave a comment below, and uh, and I'll uh, converse with you. All right, guys. Until next time. Peace out.